Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having a great day. Today I am playing the river course at Country Club of Whispering Pines. Um, not a long course, but definitely a challenge. Um, definitely to be good at placing the ball. So, so you guys should be in for a fun video. And here we go, let's get started in this video. First hole, 462 yard par five. There's a creek out there. Gonna be hitting two on right at that tall bushy tree right there. And let's see what we can do. All right, so not the greatest tee shot there. We are just a little right of the fairway. Um, lie's not the best, it's kind of sitting down. So I'm gonna be hacking a seven iron out there and just try to advance it forward. Uh, not the greatest start there. Um, bears are a lot narrower than I thought, so I'm gonna take a little more time on those approach shots. So now, second hole, 351 yard par four. Green's right back there. Just gonna be taking a two iron, kind of right over that um, red tee marker on the left, and let's see what we can do. I uh, pushed it just right of the fairway. I uh, did cut off some, but yeah, we got terrible lies follows. I mean, you can see that ball is sitting down. So got 114 yards. We're taking a 54 degree wedge and we're just gonna try to put this one on the green. Anything close to the screen out of this lie, I'll be pretty happy with. All right, not the best start there. Just not putting myself in good positions off the tee. Out to the third hole, 351 yards. We hit three wood right on that line. Let's see what we can do. All right, good tee shot there. Um, it's my first time playing the course, so I don't really know where the fairways stick out to. Um, next time I play here, I'll definitely be hitting probably a two or four iron just to make sure I hit this fairway. But probably got about 85, 75 yards left. Let's see if we can put it close.
at good par there. Um, would have liked to make that birdie putt, but these greens are brand new and doesn't doesn't feel like they've kind of grown out yet. So still a little soft and a little slower than I thought, but pars are never bad. Now we're on to the fourth hole, 416 yard par four. Just gonna be ripping driver just right out of that cart path with a little draw. And let's see if we can get out there and play. Uh, not a bad shot there. That's approximately where I was and that's where I've ended up. Um, still missed the fairway as you guys saw, but these fairways are <laughs> these fairways are really narrow, so um, anyway, we got a birdie putt here. It's gonna be a tough downhill to see if we can light close and make a par. Uh, another not great hole. I'm not swinging it bad. I'm just not putting myself in the correct spots. Um, and that's that's why I thought would be the fun part about this course is you really gotta uh, hit your spots, and that's something I'm not the best at doing. So this is good practice for me, and hope it's still an entertaining video for you guys. But I don't think we're that far off. Just a couple good swings. And I think we can get it right back. Let's see if we can get started on this hole. This is hole number five. Par 360 yards to that front pin. It's not a downhill, but there is a little bit of a headwind. So we're going to be taking a 9 iron, maybe a soft 8. I think I'm going to go soft 8 and just fly it down a little bit and see if we can put it close. Uh, good par there. Um, got a little lucky with that chip. Definitely didn't play the best shot there, but uh, rolled out right where I needed it to. So definitely, definitely got a little lucky there. Uh, now on to hole six, 380 yard par four. There's a green there. We're going to be ripping driver and just trying to take it inside these trees. Let's see what we can do. <laughs> so that was one crazy shot right there. Uh, had our first fairway of the day. Unfortunately, it wasn't our own fairway. But right back there, my ball went through that pine tree. I think it also clipped this tree right here. And we got about a 15 foot and a half for birdie. So that was definitely an interesting shot. But see if we can um, see if we can make use out of it and. Try to make our first birdie of the day. I 
<laughs> definitely a very interesting part of there, but part nonetheless. So we will take it and move on to hole number seven. It's a par five, 539 yards. Slight dog leg left where we're taking it probably just right at the little path right here. But let's try to hit a slight draw and see what we can do. Uh, really good drive there. Our first actual fairway of the day. So now we have about 240 to that pin. So we're going to rip them two iron and see if we can get on this green too. Be good. Go. It should be on. So, two good shots, and then after that, not not great. We're starting to put ourselves in a good position, which is what we need to be doing. Uh, now it's just time to capitalize on those. Let's see if we can do it here on number eight. It's a 322 yard par four. Technically it is drivable, so I'm gonna be taking driver right up out on that line. And let's see if we can put it close to the screen. Uh, really good drive right there, just shore of the screen. Um, you can see just kind of how narrow this course is. Cool part about this, these two holes is that's number two right there. On the other side of that little mound, um, there's a little lake, so, and the road's actually right up top as well. So when you're driving in, you see these holes here, then you got the lake on that side of the road. You see a car going by right there. But just a cool touch when you're driving in. So let's see if now to get back to the shot and see if we can chip this one close and capitalize on a birdie opportunity. Unfortunately, another waste opportunity there. Um, I walked up to my ball and my ball actually plugged right there. So it carried almost all the way to the screen. So a couple months when everything kind of dries out, um, that might be a little too much club, you never know. But, and we're just wasting opportunities, but we're, we're giving ourselves putts. So that's all that matters eventually. Um, we'll let them all go in. So on to number nine. 196 yards to that pin right there. And we're taking a seven iron slightly downhill. I'm just trying to put it anywhere on this screen and see if we can make a birdie or no, or at worst a par.
Yeah, a little, a little frustrating there. Ninth hole, I still don't have the green speeds down. Um, yeah. Like I said, I'm not putting myself in bad spots anymore. I'm just not converting, and that's a prime example of it right there. Anyway, on to the 10th hole. Last part five of the day. That tree right there is 283, so we're hitting driver with a cut. Try to just play it off that and see if we can get in the fairway. Uh, this one went a little through the fairway. Um, did what I wanted to it cut. Unfortunately, it started at these bushes here and not at this tree. So, um, all in all, not terrible. Don't think I can reach the green here, so we're just going to lay it up and see if we can get there in three. Oh my god, you're fucking joking. Oh man, some days you're just gonna not make anything. I feel like Bryson um, at the match just couldn't get, can't get any putts to drop. I'm giving myself opportunities and I gave myself a really good one right back there, but just not getting it to drop which is really kind of frustrating but at the same time i know if i keep giving myself um opportunities one of them's going to eventually drop so still got eight holes left so let's see if we can keep giving ourselves opportunities 11th hole here this hole is 380 yards and this is where the course really starts to get, starts to get interesting this is why it's known as the river course these next probably three or four holes all revolve around the river so should be interesting. We're gonna be taking a two iron, probably just right or just left of that 150 mark. And let's see what we can do. I pulled my t-shirt just a little bit. Um, wait, we are getting some brutal eyes in this rough. I mean, that ball, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I mean, that ball is buried. So, we're just taking a nine iron. I'm gonna play it to come out dead, so I take a nine iron. Just try to get it up there. We have 150 in. So let's see if we can get this on the green. really happy with that shot there um ball totally felt like it came out hot but i ended up going a pretty good distance um i don't know i don't think my for fun driver made it i will go check and if i find it, i'll let you guys know but i don't think i made it probably went in that water right there but this is the shot that counts so let's see if we can roll it in
Alright, we're getting closer. Just missed that one. That one really just kind of died off left at the end, but still a pretty good putt. Now on to hole 12, 393 yards. We got this river going the entire right side. Um, are you taking driver? Play just at those bunkers. And let's see what we can do. Yeah, just a little, a little off with the driver again. Um, got 167 into this pin. Gonna be hitting this eight iron right at it and see if we can put it close. Alright, so not the prettiest par, but a par nonetheless. Um, you know, we just gotta keep looking at the positives. We're making a lot of pars today. Um, I hit our irons pretty well, so. Anyway, on to hole 13 now, 345 yard par four. Straight into a headwind. We got water here, water up by the green. So we're just gonna be ripping two iron right at those bushy trees. And let's get out and play. All right, got 140 yards to the pin. Gonna be hitting pitch and wedge, probably just left. Let's see if we can put it on. Uh, another not bad par there. We're giving ourselves opportunities, um, but we're just not hitting good tee shots. I think that's the biggest problem. If I start hitting a couple fairies the last couple holes and keep hitting my irons the way I am, I should have a couple more, a little bit better uh, birdie opportunities. But yeah, we gotta start driving it better first. <laughs> but now on to 14, 140 yards to that pin today. Um, we're taking probably a pitching wedge and just going right at it and see if we can stick it close. I cannot buy a putt today. Uh, like I said, you're gonna have days like this. I'm gonna have days like this though. And it's just about, you gotta keep grinding and hitting good shots and hope one of them will eventually fall. But so far they haven't. All right, on to hole 15 now, 384 yards. Could be taking three wood, probably right on that line, just over that right yellow T marker. And let's see if we can play it in the fairway.
I uh, did just pull this one a little left of my line. Got lucky though, I think it might have clipped those trees and kicked it back into play. So, got 111 yards to that pin. Got just a little bit of tree trouble. I should be okay, but never know. So, we're gonna take him to 54 degree and see if we can put it close. All right, another good par there. Um, just need to start driving it better. That's really all it is. Can't spin it out of this rough, so it's hard to put balls close. Anyway, on to 1,681 yard par three. Maybe ripping seven on right that pin, see if we can put it close. Try to make our first birdie of the day. Oh man, just can't buy a putt. We're rolling it well, hitting good shots, so just got just gotta keep going, keep grinding along. Now into 17, 431 yard par four. Green is just right or just left of that bunker, so we send driver out over that left yellow T marker and see if we can get one in the fairway. Really nice drive there. Our first fairway on the back nine. So hopefully that means good things to come. Got 120 yards into that pin. Let me hang it 50 degree. Just kind of knock it down and see if we can put it close. All right, another par there. Hit our first favorite of the back nine and then missed our first green of the back nine. So yeah, we got definitely blew an opportunity there, especially only having 120 yards in, but still a little make par. So now onto our final hole, 18, 416 yards. There's the green there. We're a ripping driver just the right edge of that bunker and see what we can do. Uh, fortunately, the ball did not quite draw back. So a little right of the fairway again. Got 135 yards to that pin. We've taken probably a pitching wedge. Let's see if we can put it close and try to make a bird, our first birdie on the last hole. 